Hey guys, the Ultimate Gamer 19 here, and welcome to part 60 of Let's Play The Sims 2 The Anderson Season 3. This is Samantha's family. I kind of rhymes again. Uh, I think it always rhymes. It always does. So, as you can see, in the last part, I believe Katie was stuck on the toilet, and there's like a bug, so she got like, you know, stuck. Yeah. And that's where I ended off, I believe. So now I fixed the glitch, like I, like I said I would, and I just tried the idea of moving them in and moving them out, and I kind of, I kind of lost all the furniture we had in my house. So I decided to why not renovate, why not remodel, make it better looking than before, and just have some new stuff <clears throat> because we, I thought we needed a new look anyways. So. Let's give, I'm going to give you guys a little house tour. So nothing much with the kitchen or the dining room so far. Pretty much with some other rooms, it's not much. But I did kind of do a little bit of renovating. So I put a half wall right here. Not really like a, a huge wall, like a wall right here or a wall right there. I just took that out and put a half wall here because I felt like there, that wall here, the big wall here, was not necessary. So a half wall would be good. And just your general uh, kitchen stuff and a little toddler table for Katie when she needs to eat her little food and uh, once again the dining room is not really that much different it's just added a little bit I think this is new new tables and chairs and I added flowers here to give it a little more environment the bathrooms are not any different they're pretty much feel like they're the same I feel uh, nothing much with the bedroom either nothing much and we'll get to the back later, you guys you can see there's the back. So upstairs we have Oh, this is my favorite part I think. Actually I think the the other room is my favorite part, but this is probably my second favorite. Uh this room here is like sort of a mix. I guess you could like listen to music. I guess you could dance here if you had any room. I think you have room to dance. Uh go into the computer. Uh you can skill up with these books and stuff and learn stuff. I couldn't find a rug that could like, I don't know why I couldn't find a rug that was like four spaces, like usually rugs are only three spaces, that's what I only found, and it was either huge or s too small, so I just put in a uh, two space rug under here, and as you can see the toddler Katie's room is a little bit different, a little bit different, and you may be wondering why is there a fridge there, that was because I didn't want to go to... I didn't want Samantha or Nawaf to continuously just go down here to get a bottle and go upstairs to get a bottle for her, so why not put a refrigerator in her room? Why not? And by the way, the half fridge, the mini fridge, does not have bottles. It can't hold bottles for some reason, so that's a bummer. I also feel like my volume is too high. Is that just me? I'm going to put the, the voices down a little bit in sound effects. I think the volume is just me. I'll lower that for me. So, and a uh, telescope is right here. It's kind of, it would actually fit here because there's a huge window right here. So I thought, why not put the telescope here? And you have enough room to look out into the stars. I think you would be able to. I think that's it for the upstairs. All right, so now finally I have to show you the, uh, the other room that I just built. This is the gym where you could uh, work out and do all your fitness stuff and I actually added a little bit of decorations and posters on the wall I think it was just two <laughs> a painting and a poster it's sort of like to motivate you like to become really fit and healthy and all that good stuff so I added that and these are like and I found them I was like oh this could fit this room so I just put it in here and without these posters or paintings it would look pretty bland and I think it still kind of does kind of just yeah, I think that's it. That's all the tour I have to give you. As you can see, we have like some neighbors coming here since we just moved back in. Of course, the game has to have neighbors come and visit us. And uh, it looks like Glenn is here. Glenn Howe. Glenn Howe. Glenn Howe, Courtney, Jexu. And there was like another guy here. I don't know where he went, though. Is he still here? I think he left. I'm not going to invite Glenn into the house. He's nasty. He just farts all over the place and burps a lot. He's a slob. What can I say? Uh, so in this part, we'll try to get Nawaf and Samantha to fall in love with each other again and have them engaged at least in this part. That's my objective. And Katie, hopefully she can uh, get older and hopefully grow up in this part as long as I keep recording and not stop a lot.
Alright, so... Let's go ahead and have Samantha put Katie in her crib because Katie is getting pretty tired. So let's just do that real quick. And... yeah. Of course, everyone wants to touch the baby. Everyone wants to do that. We've had our experiences with past toddlers and children. I mean, not children. It's just toddlers and babies. They're, people... Sims like to obsess. They're, they're just obsessed with babies. They seriously do. And a random random uh pause my bad <laughs> so here's katie's put jam jams i'll give you guys a little look it's sort of like a bear or a cub i'll we'll call it a bear a cub it's a cub costume pajamas so i'm gonna let her sleep and when she wakes up i think we'll have her use the potty because she could use the potty some potty training pretty soon i fixed the seasons it was kind of messed up before you probably didn't notice that though um so it goes summer fall winter and spring i think that that is right most definitely <clears throat> what kind of sucks is that when nawaf was resurrected he, he starts his whole life all over again so it's gonna take him some time to get catch up with samantha and you guys should thought you guys should thought huh? you guys said that we should make samantha as young as nawaf we're not gonna do that we're just gonna wait until nawaf gets to a certain extent and then we'll have samantha i guess be as young as him i don't want to do that right now i don't want to make her young right now and if you watched the previous episode you would know that her twin has passed away josh died and a lot of you have been asking me if I could, if I could resurrect him or bring him back. I, I'm not 100% sure if I will. I mean, everything happens for a reason, right? Just just let it happen. I mean, that would be cheating to resurrect him. I mean, there's no other source of way of bringing him back besides using. We can't use the resurrect onomatron because I think I kind of cheated to get that in the game. So I'm not going to bring back the Resurrect Onomatron because that is a career reward that I need to unlock. And the only way I guess we could resurrect him is by using the the genie lamp, which I don't think we have. Let me check real quick. Do we have a genie lamp? I don't think we have a genie lamp anymore. I think we lost it. Oh yeah, I forgot it was like right here. The genie lamp was right here and then when I moved out it like got kind of erased. So eh, well actually why would we have a never mind i just i just realized why would we need a genie lamp here at samantha's family no idea so i guess we'll have to check on rochelle's home to see if she has a genie lamp if not then i guess we'll have to wait for another one hopefully it comes more than once hopefully that matchmaker comes here psycho psych psychic comes here uh right now samantha needs some fun oh look 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 katie is like almost fully rested might as well wake her up right now and have her potty train be potty trained i'm gonna save my game real quick just in case if something happens like a bug or glitch or what if a random crash happens i don't know something could happen i'm gonna up the music a little bit just saying just because i'm gonna, gonna listen to some later on okay potty trainer Freaking Courtney wants to talk to that baby through the teddy bear. Okay, let me put the teddy bear back what it, where it was originally. Thank you. Thank you very much. And it's a good thing it's fall right now because her skills can... I mean, her learning is faster because it's fall. I don't know why. It just is. Only two days left before Katie's birthday with an aspiration meter as full as Katie's. How full is it? It's gold. Okay. There's not much to worry about. Just make sure to avoid any fear so that Katie can carry that aspiration. Okay, blah, blah, blah. Okay, I'm going to have Katie go over here. And then let's empty this. Just just now. Let's just empty that. And then we're going to dispose this. I'm going to buy a little trash can real quick. Just a mini one. Put it like... I don't know, right here. Will that work? I like the... Uh, set up here for the table. It looks really fancy. I don't know. That's not fancy. I suppose that's. Oh. 
And she needs some social, so I'm gonna go ahead and have her teach Katie to walk. Let's do that. And the wife is gonna talk to Courtney here, because Courtney wants to talk to him. You guys may have noticed that she kind of does look like Samantha, but her eyes are kind of creepy. Look at this. There, this is not no ordinary eye color. Seriously. This is not no ordinary eye color. I don't even remember this being in my... Oh yeah, I forgot I downloaded some new eye colors for Sims. So maybe she's one of those pre-made Sims that just come along with that. And the clothes, too. Hmm. Noah is such a he has such good sense of humor. That's why he laughs so hard, so loud. He's not getting along with her. Hmm. I was going to ask her to leave. I'd expect them to have a little social. I mean, you're still talking to your mummy. Your yeah, mommy. Why don't you get any social from that? I don't think that counts as social. Oh, well. Uh, she's pretty good on her motives. So I'm just going to keep speeding this up. And Maybe she could learn how to walk right now. Maybe she could. By the time she's done, her energy would be... Oh, yay, she taught her how to walk. Yay, that's an accomplishment. Okay, let's see if she needs to... Let's just go and have her snuggle, family kiss. Oh, she's platinum. Awesome. Okay, let's check her motives. Social needs to go up a little bit more. Uh, play... Tickle. Tickle her. Toss Katie in air. And we're gonna put her... Should we put her back in the crib? Let's give her her bottle before we put her in the crib. Oh, isn't that nice? Okay, let's give her a bottle real quick. And now I believe she can use her toilet, use the toilet on her own now, which is good. That's great, very handy. <clears throat> so go use. Can you use the potty by yourself? Oh wait, no, 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 wait, wait. wait. She has to be potty trained to know how to, to do that by herself. Dang it! Dang, nabbit. Okay, just put her in the crib now. Just do it. Good night, you little piece of crap. She's probably saying that. Just kidding, that's me. Alright, let's have Samantha fill up her needs. I was about to say motives. That's the same thing. Uh, where's the TV at? Where's the TV? Surprisingly, she's not that tired. Okay, let's have her go to sleep now. Uh, what's Nawaf? Okay, we'll cut back in when Nawaf wakes up, I believe. Alright, Nawaf is going to go ahead and have... He already woke up and Samantha as well, because they both got out at the same time. Nawaf is going to potty train Katie. Hopefully, they make it. Okay, yeah, they made it. <coughs> she wants to learn how to talk and get potty trained. Let's just use it. Mm. Samantha wants to talk to her through the bear. Talk to Noaf? Yeah, talk to Noaf over there. Suppose that. And go play with. Actually, go play with some blocks. <coughs> or maybe not. My, what? Yeah, whatever. Taking care of babies is really easy as long as you don't have a lot of them. I mean, if you have a lot, it'll be a lot more difficult to handle, but as long as we have one, that's fine. Having one is alright. That's the best, actually. And when those toddlers grow up into children, then you can probably have another child is my kind of advice of getting, you know, raising and growing children. Having children. Raising children. Raising and growing. That's redundant. Yeah, when you're raising children. Alright, so she's gonna make some... What did I have her make? I forgot already. Probably pancakes. She's making pancakes right now. And he's gonna give her a bath. Oh, maybe not. 
Do you just want her to dip into the... Okay, whatever. Don't just dip her in the bathtub. What are you doing? Give her an actual bath. Don't dip her. I don't like... Oh my god. I hate that. I mean, you set out plates for two people and you get an extra one for yourself. That makes a lot of sense. Okay. Put her down. Okay, good, good job. Okay, let her do that. And you go eat s some pancakes as well. And he does not have work today. But I believe Samantha does. She has nine vacation days. That's a lot. Jeez. Do you have any more things to fill? I think hers is complete now. That's why she has platinum for the rest of her life. So that's good. She's all set. And Nawaf is getting there. What about her? Social comforts, bladder and hygiene. Actually, no, 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 no. I actually want her to be potty trained faster, so we'll just keep one right there. That's it. He's like, oh, it smells good, honey. Not really. Should we call her honey yet? They're crushes, so why not? Samantha's getting the pieces and cuisine, croissant. Bon appetit, Samantha. Your interest in cuisine is admirable, and I would like to directly extend an invitation to Sue's Secret Kitchen, a place sure to get to whet your appetite. Whet your appetite. Mm -hmm. Oh. Ba boom, ba boom, get dark. <laughs> I don't like this show, but it's funny. I don't like it. Wait, is it get burp? Get burp, not get derp. Go get derp. Alright, so he has work at 10pm. Wait, actually no, he doesn't have work today. What the heck? She has work at 10am. <clears throat> I think I'm going to have him get fit again. Get super fit. Let's go to the gym here. Let's go to our gym. And first thing we're going to test out is the music working out thing. Uh, I can't talk today. Don't be surprised. Alright, work out. <gasps> is he going to really work out on the mat? Oh, he's not. Maybe that's just like his feet is halfway on them. Eh. Whatever. This is work working out. The music. Yeah, you can you can work out to um salsa or our type of genre that is. Katie is going to need to sleep pretty soon. I'm gonna have her put in her in the bed now in the crib. Put her where where'd she go? Go put her in the crib. Okay, Katie stop. Now Samantha put her in the crib. Carpool for Samantha will arrive in about an hour. Just go do it right now. Okay. Oh, I forgot to, uh... Forgot to... Change their owner to their car. Okay, so Samantha's gonna drive this car. And Wolf is gonna drive this car. So, let's have her drive to work right now. Okay, she drive to work? I don't think so. Maybe next time tomorrow, if she can drive to work tomorrow. Oh, well. So, you go get dressed for work. Because you're gonna go to work pretty soon. Office is still working out. And Katie is in the crib, so we don't have that much to worry about. I feel like I should do some things off camera because, I mean, there's nothing much, I guess. Maybe not. I'll just keep this going as it is. Don't wanna skip anything. Okay, so she's gonna go to work now. Or maybe she can drive to work. Okay, I thought the carpool was gonna come for her, but nope. Okay. Oh, la 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 la. And is he fully fit? Yes, he is fully fit. Yes, <laughs> yes, he's fully fit. So go ahead and uh, take your shower because you stink now, and go use the restroom. I'll be right back. 
All right, I s just kind of skipped through a little bit of things. So Katie woke up and sh I had Nawaf body train her and now she's just... Oh wait, you forgot to drink your bottle. Go drink your bottle. Nawaf is just going to sit down, get his comfort up a little bit and browse the web for arts and crafts. Because why not? And the pancakes are spoiled. I forgot to put them in the fridge for as leftovers. Oh well, we have omelets, I think, in the fridge now. So, we have leftovers? What the heck? What the crap? Okay, I think we have omelets in there. I don't know. I'm just going to have him sit here for a little bit. I don't know why he's tired. Right? Oh yeah, because he worked out. He's tired still. No, no problem. Okay, this bear is causing nightmares. It's just blocking the way. I don't think we even need a bear. Do we need a bear? I don't think so right now. Drink, drink the bed hell, the bed hell. <laughs> she looks so cute when she's walking. I like how they like mumble each time they just stop drinking on it, sipping on it, sucking on it. That sounds inappropriate. Yeah, you know what I mean. But I didn't mean to. I mean, she is sucking on a bottle. How, well, that's not inappropriate if you, unless you think about it that way. <laughs> At least I'm not. Okay, Halloween is approaching. Wow, Halloween already? Oh yeah, it's in the fall. Halloween is in the fall. Halloween is approaching and Samantha always makes her own costume. She's not sure, however, if she w should wear it to work on Halloween. If co-workers will wear costumes, it would make sense. Otherwise, Samantha might stand out in a bad way. Should Samantha wear her costume to work? Hmm... If you are going to work, I mean, work is like a business. Work is business, and it requires some seriousness. And sometimes, I think sometimes some workplaces need to like lay off a little bit of the work business and stuff, and have fun with their costumes and and all. But I mean, if you wear a costume to work and you're nah, don't wear the costume. Samantha decides to leave the costume at home, but is talking about it at work when one of her colleagues asks if she has any pictures. Samantha shows some of her, some, and her colleague is so impressed she hands her, he, she, he hands her a membership card to a secret lot. See, look, wow, these decisions that I've been making have been positive so far. Maybe because I've been thinking it out more. I don't know. Or is it because I have that little business thing where you get most most of your opportunities, most of those opportunities. Or like right, I don't know. I think it was the lifetime thing. Just me, I don't know. So his comfort is up. I'm gonna go ahead and have him take a nap. I should sleep a little bit. Actually, why not nap? Why not nap? I wish they had power naps here in Sims 2. Like, just they have it in Sims 3 power naps. Is that a power nap in Sims? Do they have power naps in Sims 3? I don't know. All right, so. When it hits 6 o'clock, uh, Katie is going to be able to grow up, and I think I'll save that for the next episode. So until then, um, if you like the video, why not give it a thumbs up? And if you want to continue watching this series or any other series that you're interested in, why not click the subscribe button if you haven't already. Stay tuned for more videos. Make sure to stay up to date with me on my social networkers, social networkers, <laughs> such as Facebook or Twitter. I haven't been really updating a whole lot, but I'm going to remind myself to update here and there. Uh, you'll get exclusive updates of when and what I'll be uploading. Make sure to check out my website as well to stay informed. And remember, it's not 100% accurate, so it just kind of gives you an idea of what I might do. So, yeah, keep that in mind. So hopefully all of you have a wonderful day, and I'll see you guys in another video.